Welcome guys. Today I'm going to talk about the top three crypto that are going to make you a millionaire this year in about a year and a half or maybe even way sooner. What's up YouTube community? My name is Syed and welcome to Invest Desk, your number one channel for cryptocurrency investing, regular updates, news and forecasts. And we are going to talk about the top three crypto that are going to make you a millionaire. So first things first, before I talk about these coins, two things that I like to, of course, set the record straight. Number one, the majority of my portfolio is mainly Dogecoin, Bitcoin, Ethereum, Cardano, Chili's, and of course, the chain. But that doesn't mean that all these coins are going to make it right because you take on risk when you invest. And number two, of course, you know that I'm not a financial advisor. So ultimately, I would not know what the price would do tomorrow. But I do my regular research. I have a PhD and, of course, a degree in finance and I share my expertise. So let's jump right in and coming at number three. Is chilies. No, it's not the chilies that you eat, but it is way hotter than you even think. Chili's is the world's leading blockchain fintech provider for sports and entertainment. In other words, Chili's is a currency option for blockchain backed products and services that are geared towards mainstream consumers. And it provides sports and entertainment entities with blockchain based tools to help them engage and monetize their audience. So currently Chili's ranks at about 35. It's a market cap of a little over 3 billion US dollars. And the volume is a little over 1 billion USD. But what really makes Chili's unique? Chili's and of course Socios.com claim to be the first platforms to really build a bridge between the blockchain technology and the sports world. So by issuing blockchain based tokens, Chili is simply ensuring their fans that they have their investment secure and protected while participating from anywhere in the world. So Chili's allow sport fans to participate in the management of their favorite teams. What that implies is that by buying fan tokens, these users can secure their voting rights and participate in votes announced by the teams on the website, which further boosts the decentralization features offered by the Chili's blockchain. It also uses a proof of authority sidechain consensus mechanism for maintaining security. And unlike Proof of work and proof of stake, proof of authority relies on reputability of already established validators for the creation of new blocks. So to make these transactions processing as fast as possible, the proof of authority consensus simply relies on the Byzantine fault tolerance algorithm known as the BFT algorithm with identity as a stake. And it is really more cost effective than the POW, which is the proof of work consensus in terms of electrical and computing power consumption. Where can you go and buy Chili's? There are several platforms. One of them is, of course, Binance. You can buy it at Parabu. You can buy it at Upbit and so on. So definitely Chili's holds a promising future. Currently, it's at 0.55 as of today, but it definitely is setting its standards and benchmark moving forward. All right, coming at number two. is BitTorrent with over 1 billion users. The BitTorrent protocol is the world's largest decentralized protocol out there. The number of users far surpasses Bitcoin, the second largest decentralized application. Bitcoin has a little over 32 million addresses and this was back a couple of years ago. So in the last two decades, BitTorrent clients have been downloaded and installed billions of times. The two clients created and maintained by BitTorrent are in use today by more than 100 million monthly active users around the world and growing exponentially. And for the last decade or so, BitTorrent has been exploring distributed applications. So they are looking into both adaptations of the BitTorrent protocol as well as the creation of an entirely new protocol with the aim of providing services including distribution messaging, BitTorrent based CDN, peer-to-peer -peer live video streaming and file synchronization. So what is the reason of the growth of BitTorrent recently? It's simply what they have examined is that the internet users 
are reluctant to pay for digital goods and services online with fiat currency. Instead, they pay with their attention. And of course, another reason is that there's a large untapped market for the application of BitTorrent technology to new use cases. And this BitTorrent token, by the way, is tokenizing the world's largest decentralized file sharing protocol with its BTT, which is basically a TRC-10 utility token based on the blockchain that powers features of the most popular decentralized protocols and applications in the entire world. And the BitTorrent file system, also known as the BTFS, is both a protocol and network implementations that provides the peer-to-peer -peer or P2P mechanism for storing and sharing digital content in a decentralized filing system. But what sets BitTorrent apart? The vision really is important. So when individuals choose to basically seed their files, which is the process of sharing files with other individuals across the globe, they can then choose to get rewarded with BTT for torrents using their bandwidth and resources. And that is really what is making BTT growing exponentially as part of this vision. So this process named BitTorrent Speed helps with downloading speed and incentivizes users to keep their files on the torrenting software, which in turn, of course, will give users the ability to download files that they want more easily. BTT tokens also have monetary value as well, which means that users can convert their tokens into fiat money or spend it to unlock benefits on the network. So currently BTT has 0 0.00295780, which is relatively a low price to get into BTT, although it has grown exponentially in the last few weeks. So BitTorrent, of course, holds also a promising future and growth. All right, coming at number one. Is VeChain. We are controlled by the few. The powerful and the greedy. We should be free, free to choose, to trade, to create. It is time for a new world. A world founded on safety and security. A world where everything you do creates power. the shape of this world. The power to change the future is in your hands. V-Chain. And V-T-H-O. So the VeChain Thor blockchain consists of two token system. The VeChain token, the symbol is VET, which will act as a store and transfer of value. And the VeChain Thor energy, also known as VThor or VTHO as its symbol. So the VThor is the gas of the VeChain ecosystem. The VTHO is needed to pay for writing data to the VeChain Thor blockchain. And that means that every transaction, whether it's sending tokens or sending data to a smart contract, has to be paid for in VTHO or VThor. And the amount of VTHO that is needed for a transaction depends on the size of the data you want to send. For example, a simple VET transaction costs you around 30 VTHO, while sending a transaction filled with data to a smart contract can cost a thousand VTHO. So this unique dual token system of VET plus VTHO significantly helps separate the cost of using blockchain from market speculation and that really is what driving the price of these tokens to the sky or to the moon. 
due to the correlation with the blockchain resource utilization, the cost is more predictable with the monitoring of the VTHO supply and demand. Also, the foundation's governance mechanism further stabilizes the cost itself. So the VTHOR token, by the way, right now is at 0 0.02203 as we speak. So what makes VTHOR token unique? It's Primary uniqueness is due to the fact that it is a VIP 180 standard token. What that means is while VeChain tokens like VET performs as the primary value transfer token, the VThor is an inseparable part of the operation of the VeChain Thor. The buy token design of this blockchain simply allows traders to participate with both tokens thus diversifying their involvement with the project. The VeChain Thor blockchain boasts increased processing speeds and open source design, allowing developers to pull together their efforts. And VeChain Thor also developed a meta transaction features, which allows participants to organize multi-party payments and multi-task transactions. And it is really this versatility that allows enterprise users of all levels to benefit from the blockchain capabilities. The VeChain Thor token also relies on proof of authority consensus mechanism, which allows it to validate transactions very, very quickly. So where can you buy VeThor token? You can get it at Binance, you can get it at Oceanics, and there are other exchanges as well. But understand that VeChain VET was one of the first blockchains that was built exclusively to cater to needs of enterprise level clientele. And the developers behind this particular project simply seek to improve supply chain and product lifecycle management through the use of the distributed ledger technology. But more importantly, this platform offers users a variety of new functionalities that make it ideal for businesses seeking to enhance supply chain protocol and businesses processes. And we know that VeChain is a pioneer in the integration of Internet of Things and DLT technologies. And VeChain also borrowed one thing from Ethereum, which is its dual token strategy. And this supply or in this style of blockchain ecosystem, one token simply serves as a public investment or digital cash, and the other is for smart contract execution and programming. And these really are the two main advantages to this strategy. The first advantage is that this system provides effective governance. Blockchains need to have governance models, of course, that include the community or the risk hard forks from unhappy community members. And the second reason to use the dual token strategy is that it provides your blockchain with a predictable economic model. And that's where VeChain token is a cryptocurrency that you would invest in on an exchange. It serves as an increment of value within the VeChain blockchain. And of course, the VeChain Thor or VTHO is the second token as part of this group. So the second token, which is the VTHO, as I mentioned earlier, is the VeChain systems in the VeChain Thor Energy. And this token functions as gas to power smart contract transactions. And I mentioned this already. So the combination of these two is really what is setting this crypto apart from all the rest. Therefore, it is on the number one on my list. And of course, you can buy VET also on Binance, you can buy it in Kraken, you can buy it in Bittrex and other exchanges as well. So there you have it. Let me know what you think about these three crypto. Hope they were useful and I hope they were beneficial. Let me know. Put a comment down below. And of course, be sure to subscribe, comment and hit the bell notification so you get notified every single time I come up with the new video. And of course, I stream every single day so you can get the latest updates, news, forecasts, and price predictions right here on Invest Desk. With this, hit the subscribe button, and I will see you in the next video.